So will you think that it's super cheesy? Will you agree with him? We'll find. Let's find out together. I'll have to. I'll have to edit that. Mm -hmm. Will you find out? <laughs> so will you agree that this is a classic horror film? Let's see. Once you mess up once, it's, it's hard to get. So will you agree that this is a? So will you in turn? So will you? How should I say it? Will you in time? Uh, so, all right, so here we are. No, that, that's terrible. We could never do this in front of a live audience, no. <laughs> it just would, so. it wouldn't work. But people would think we were really good at it. What I, where I was going with all that is that, um. I don't know where I was going. I should probably edit that back out. Well, no, I mean you made some good points there. I, I, don't, yeah. I don't know if that's how, how should I how should I how should I wrap it back up again? Where, where where was I at? Global warming. We should necessarily believe in it just because they're yeah okay. Check. One, two, three. Okay. I don't know what that was doing. So what is Sad Boys? It's a clothing company. Okay. Were you inspired to wear pink when I from me wearing pink uh, on Easter? No. Okay. Because, no. you know, it takes a certain degree of... Uh, Real men wear pink. I understand that. Glad you've experienced that self-actualization. Okay. We have that also on tape. Um, so, Ryan. You ready? Mm -hmm. You're in a room with six entrances. Through each entrance and exit, you may experience life or death. How, how should we do this? In this review, we review... In this review, we review... Ryan checking his email. <laughs> So what do you think the content should be? Probably should have brainstormed this. <clears throat> Here, let me let me just do some takes. Okay, yeah, I'm trying to. I'm trying to <clears throat> there, but... In this edition of Beckner and Lipscomb, we review the film Cube. You're trapped in a cube. In this edition of Beckner and Lipscomb, we review the film. What year was it? Ninety-five. In this edition of Beckner and Lipscomb, we review the classic horror film Cube from 19 what? 95. 95. 95. 95. I can't. I-75-95. All right. We're good. <clears throat> Hold on. In this edition of Beckner and Lipscomb at the Movies, we review the classic horror film Cube from 1995. You're trapped in a structure that you don't understand. Six entrances and exits, and through each is life or death. What do you do? Why are you there? What does it mean? That's pretty good. I shouldn't have said that so soon, probably. <laughs> you want to add something to that? No, that was good. I think that was, I mean, that was, pretty, much, that was pretty much it right there. That okay. Was... Well, we could maybe brainstorm these. We could work with these in the future and try to like come up with better okay. ideas. But for a first one, I was, think that's was fine. that perfect? Okay. Yeah, that's that, that pretty did, much. Did I say to. join us on the join us? Click on the. No, should you I, didn't should I say that? But I mean, I don't know if you necessarily need to with that. Okay. Should, was was there anything I should do to close it? No, I think mean, that was great. That was really good. Okay. To be honest with you, surprised me a little bit there. Proud of you. Right. Is it? For sure. Yeah, I mean, I would. I mean, yeah, that was that was fine, dude. That was, Do you want to say anything that for you to be, or were you just going the whole time? I was just picking my nose. <laughs> going, yeah. I got a big one right here. <laughs> yeah, that was good. Yeah, that was good. All right, so you're you're happy with that? Yeah, yeah. I think okay. It'll, yeah, that'll be good. Okay. Yeah, and then once you uh, so put the teaser trailer up, obviously for the link on Facebook, and then I'll see if I can get how much it would cost us 